Hey, Mazi, asante sana for joining us for another classic episode of the Wicked Edition. I'm your host, Dr. Kingori. We have a great show lined up for you. And, you know, before to Rudy back na ma episodes mpia za this year, I asked kwa mtandao who you'd love to see on the show. And one of the most mentioned in the comments is one of the top female entertainers in the country who fits the profile yourself made. Three episodes in, we've managed to set it up. King Kalala is in the house. Hey, Mazi. Asante Sana will be talking to her in a bit, but first I have to admit that, um, and I know you, are, you, you will agree that this has been the most eventful week of 2023 yet. One of the highlights of the week is China Square, the Chinese mall on Thika Road that has pierced through the heart of Nyamakema and almost all the businesses in Nairobi town. You know, so far we've received very many indicators that the economy is not doing well, but like for real, for real, that we are doing bad was when all businesses in Nairobi were nearly brought down by one Chinese shop. Trade, uh, trade CS, uh, CS Moses Kuria has been on the forefront defending local businesses and in one of his statements on Twitter he said that there is no special skill required to sell boxers and brass on the streets of Nairobi. Really. <laughs> this is misleading. And this tweet could be interpreted to mean that in the eyes of the CS he underrates hawkers. A lot of skill is required to sell boxers and brass on the streets of Nairobi. The average hawker can give Ferdinand Omanyala a run for his money. <laughs> Hawkers are actually uh, athletes when you work on a kitu wanafuata ama wanahepa kanjo. Athletes run for medals. Hawkers run for their lives. Very slight difference. Now, one of the points that most people seemed to agree with um, was uh, when CS uh, Moses Kuria tweeted that Kenya was open for business and not for dumping. Now this comes barely a week after reports that the European countries dump 37 million items as mtumba in Kenya every year. 37 million mtumba clothes. And they have become a problem because had the band have changed their wardrobe. <laughs> Before COVID, Goza mitumba zikingi 37 million had the band wal kuwana uh, 35 million. Saivi lewa meomoka, wakacha kuziva, hizo nguo zote asiezi valiwa na wasewa spoken word na BN. Now, <laughs> the big story has been uh, cost of living in general, and this week the opposition took their messaging to an interesting twist. Uh, when, for the first time, the oppos opposition criticized the government by offering an interesting solution. Hii Kenya kuhishi jena. Hii Kenya kuhishi jena. Ni tamu na ni mzuri kuhishi hapa inge sahi. Kwa sababu jala, tuna unga ya bure. Sini kweli? Hapa inge, unga iko wapi? Unga iko wapi? Jala kuna maximum security. Sini kweli? Hapa inge, simunashikuwa ovyo ovyo. Simunashikuwa ovyo ovyo. Jala sikuna manguo. Sikuna mablanketi. Sikuna matres. Hapa inge, hizo vitu ziko wapi? Kwa hivyo, wakenya tuisi inge ya majela. Now, I think babu wino ameni mix up kwa sababu kisema huku nje mnashikwa ovyo ovyo mnashikwa mkipelekwa wapi <laughs> And what is it with the politicians and changing tune Mahesh juzi tu ndio alikuwa anaambia watu freedom is here Sasa hiyo anaambia watu jela ndio inabamba <laughs> Now I think it's also a big contradiction from one of the most loved youthful leaders in the country to tell youth good things about prison especially in the context of cost of living because it is on record that he spent millions just to avoid going to prison himself. That said, let's cross over to our correspondents from the committee maximum prison to share the actual situation on the ground in Kenyan prisons. Unamka six, unafungulo unachukua uji. Uji unachukuliwa six. Aya, saine, saine mchana umechukua lunch. Lunch ni saine, unapiga lunch. Aya, sa saba na nusu wakati unambia, wakati unambia doctor lunch, ya nandhani ni bufe. Apana! Mwambie, Unapita songa. Kila mtu uko. Pita songa. Ukipita pita pita songa. Pita songa. songa e, kila mtu ni pita we songa. 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 So wote ni pita we songa. Pita we songa. Kila mtu anapata equal. Kila mtu anapata. Ah. Inateke meumwa uja. What they do. What they do. Kukula. Sia ni kama haki yako. Sia haki yako. Lazuma Ordinary. Sia haki yako. So umepanga line mfungo mweza kwa naigawa. So yo uyueka gatu. Pita. Weka, pita. Weka, pita. Ata akipiga miso ya enda. <laughs> Unaenda bila kitu. Ata enda, enda. kama endaga. Babu, you know, anasema people are going through tougher times than that. Mm. 
we'll investigate. Of course, we know the things that are, are hard, but for now, let's rest that debate on the cost of living. Um, we, we need to be very clear about one thing, like if it will be hard, yes, and in the first place, the government uh, need to do, the first thing the government need, needs to do is cut down on wasteful spending. Like in as much as what one are cost of living, there are some people who are just doing it for clout. You talk about how expensive your car is. Hey, maze, he buda gari, he gari wezi patana under 40 million. He kiatu, he kiatu ni akukam, maze. He ngozi ni achu, he buda. Natembea na mnyama. Apo ata siyo mnyama, ni wanyama, maze. Belt, pale, crocodile, nyoka, ni wallet. Boxer ni afisi. And... Apo umesimama uko National Park. Well, hii luku mzima buda kutoka jumpa kachini ni 140. 300k you get a bumbaka watch. These kind of people need to bring, need to be consistent. Bring the same energy kwa beya unga pia. Nyimu na lianini buda ati unga ni miambili. Iyo si unga, that's like mana from heaven. Mena kula mchanga bro. Unga napika mimi kwanza ukiipata na abuke of skuma wiki. We have a great show lined up for you. Sienda Mbali will be right back with King Kalala on the other end of this short commercial break. See you guys in a bit. Ah, Santi Sana, welcome back to the weekend edition. I'm your host, Dr. Kingori. Our guest for this episode, uh, you can go check it out on social media. One of the most requested people you want to see on the show. One of the youngest entertainers in the country, Vilen Mesema, self-made. She talked her way into a, her, into a radio job. Uh, mekuja leo to vibe sana sana on how uh, safari yake imekuwa kutoka Eldoret to um, be one of the greatest voices young people are listening to. King Kalala is in the house. <laughs> ah, was it? Long live the clan, of course. Aki wewe. Kai. Kai. Wasamaji mkubwa. Karibu sana. Long live the clan. Of course. Long live the clan. Clan, eh, clan. A define clan. Clan ni akina nani? I mean, when I say clan, my idea na kuanga. When you at the end of the day, kuna kuna nambogi ya, eh, kuna engineers, kuna doctors, kuna. Kila everybody has a place to be to belong, but then the clan is the one place where you show up and you're like, you know what? Me ni kuevi, me na feel evi, me ni komse. I'm like, you know what? Long live the clan, Caribia. We accept you for who you are. Okay. Point me as long as you're giving us mileage. Okay. Nice and easy. Okay. At the end of the day, long live the clan. Wazi. Alafu, uh, so you are the you are the clan matriarch. The king of the clan, Bwana. Oh, the king. King and the peasants. You are the king mother. Yeah. Ah? King daddy, <laughs> daddy, come on. <laughs> ah, yeah. Sawa, sawa. Uh, is this something, yo, the clan thing, ilikuja ika develop after ama even from your content ya kitambo kitambo because we for the, the, people may not know this but we tried setting this up kitambo like two years ago yeah but you are too young to travel by yourself now i i want to shout out uh of course the wicked show because nakumuka tuli go through a lot maze tuli go through place enye budango koza wendy auna degree <laughs> wendy webe auna auna degree na unenda wapi but then uh with the clan i would say that uh Mse ka Churchill. Actually, I would actually give it to Churchill, okay? Churchill came to me and told me, Kalala, I love what you're going what you're doing, I love what you're going through, I love how your brand is going through. Kitunataka ni kuwa na vibe na audience, okay? To pay ni vibe. Or can I make a situation where that the audience can relate to you? So when I was interacting with my manager, I can embeaje Kalala, una feel like about the clan. The King Kalala clan. So now, when we're looking for hashtag, it was the hashtag KKK. And you know how that looks like. Yes, it's yes, Kidogo. Yes, yes. Hey. Yeah. So now we're like, long live the clan. So let's find a place where the clan is not exact. I know rules. I know rules. Yes. Point me, kauna go through kit, wala fwase wana kulemea, ina kuwa kidogo ngumu ku mess nao, then come through. Long live the clan. We're gonna accept you, we're gonna build you, we're gonna make you who you are. Okay. So you know point here, long live the clan. Okay. The clan is going to live long because the clan is all about everybody, regardless of who you are, your gender, your color, whatever you subscribe to. Point me, long live the clan. Okay. Nice and easy. A special shout out to Baba Ya King Kalala for actually making sure, setting the standards that guests to be that in the show. That is not the guy, Bwana. No, no, no. Yes, unaharibu. I'm a set standards that guests akikuja kwa show lazima kwa ena degree. Wapi makofi yake? <laughs> Naribu, naribu. 
Haya wacha tujenge basi. Unaharibu. Now. <laughs> Now uh, mot- nini motivation yangu na especially why I'm excited to bring you on the show. Yeah. You are an example of what I keep telling people. Mm-hmm. Like uh, do what you do and let it make a way for you. Real talk. Because uh, w- when you started doing videos on your phone is how people noticed you and then you could not be ignored anymore. Sindio? Yeah. Uh, what has the journey been like? I mean, if I would take like two seconds to talk about the journey, I remember that my phone was worth uh, 17k. Okay? Okay. They will access the school portal. School portal. So what people didn't understand about me is that at the end of the day, I a place in, uh, of course, uh, life in a workout TV, but then at the end of the day, in a kunok. Case in point, I was a student in Jomo Kenyatta. I still am, kidogo working on it like, <laughs> but I'm still working on it. I'm not going to say don't do it. I'm saying do it. Okay. So far so good in a kataka life yangu, but then in a kwele place plan in a go there, yeah. try it, okay? Unafika place flani, of course, na kulemea. Either ni mzazi, ama ni maganji, ama ni unafika place. Ono nambia kali maze tupige show, nambia kalala maze kalala come do my podcast, kalala na kata. And let you kukilea kazi, okay? Kukunya na utajipa, but it's gonna take a little bit of time, okay? A little bit of time. So, what nafa kudu kama wase wakawaida, komposha, relax, okay? Si leo, si kesho, si kesho kutwa. Okay. There's gonna be an entire pandemic. So relax, inakuja. Once it gets there, relax, tafika, fika bay. Now, when, when you're in that place, I hate how people feel like kuna elemental luck. Luck is not a thing. When luck happens to you, you need to actually put hard work. Did you have a hard time convincing your parents that this thing is something else? Like what you're doing is something that can, in as much expectations uh, could provide for you a living just as JK Watt inge kusot. And I, I consistently talk about when you don't want to pay a couple of that. Well, let me check you out. Oh, that is you. Oh, that is one, two, three is here. So, see, I wouldn't say that. Nilikuwa na wazazi wangu kupali ati, hey, kina bana boy, hey, my, my, my mother's my manager. But I didn't have that uh, element from my mzazi. Mzazi wangu, alikuwa na katadi za inakoza. My dad is a professor of physics. Shout out to the guy. Amekelea kazi. Ameshugulikia, of course. At the end of the day, when you put your work in education, it's a jeeper. But they never did understand why ni kweivo. Alikuwa na kata, alikuwa na kaza. Okay? So in a finger place, funny, lazima ukaze. You have to put that, let me do it, hand, okay? okay. And the price is kidogo big, okay? Uh, design, kana toka home na, na kapatatu, when I fuck understand that, say atinda kushaina, you know, I had 3,000 now, I'm a superstar, no. With the three bands, you have to make the best out of it. Mzazi wako kufukuzi jona kudharao, ama ati weni mtumbaya, ama ati anasema ushukwe zido, wana kupea doa na kushawaji mama. Una feel uko nje wasa na kupenda, wasa kupendi, enda uko nje. Una pata bana mzazi wako kupea tautatu vu, in real life wasa wako na miambili. And if you don't make the best out of miambili, there will be gossip. Uyo demba na usikiri, pata juzi ya nikuwa mebleki kwa nje. So, I feel like, uh, at the end of the day, ukipewa kitu, usia ti lazima ukwe the best out of it, but kitu ni, if you believe in something, enda nayo, okay? Mzai wako alikupea 3K, akakuchuja home. Kapa tatu. So, E3K uliko wende wanze life, ama E3K uliko wende place flani. Ilikuwe le kadi flani ya, sasa, kaunta kuishia, liko na kapa tatu. Kaunta kusoma, ah, liko na 100 Gs. <laughs> <laughs> Utafanya gani? Ukachagua kapa tatu. Niko za muda, lai <laughs> round two. Fanya aje, Next time. As in at the end of the day, I'm not saying drop out. I'm not saying that. I'm saying at the end of the day, you have to understand, like, how does your heart feel like, okay? Mm. Your heart can feel a lot. So ensure your heart as much as it's feeling. Kuna maganju mefikiro koza, you know what? Na ingia pali na piga biz. Itaka hivi na hivi na hivi na hivi. In the next five years, three years, two years, itaka hivi na hivi na hivi. Okay. So now when I go back home, I'm like, Dad, I'm really upset that you gave me three bands and told me, get out. But then I made the best out of three bands. Mpata. So you see, you the kapatatu because you be the job. I want to do. You may say makitu kakua like, hey, I shouldn't have said that. Nah, I don't feel like I have that situation. Me lem se flani wa. I've said, I've said, I've said, I've said. Ju, I feel like ninety percent of the time I saw interaction na mimi wana feeling ni kana ropo kwa. Ni kaju mini presenta ni kona sixty thousand words akuarakisha zishe. 
and that's not the case. No, 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 I mean, as if. Uh, I usually feel like everything I say, I mean, it makes sense. Na iki kuboni ukwe, ili sipo kubona dangani. Shauri yako. Yeah. Eh. Yeah, eh, ndiyo. Kuboni ukwe? Kuna mimi ukwe. yako, kuna mimi yako watu, enda usikia vibaya uko. Pereke otakataka. <laughs> Pereke otakataka uko. Una sikia vibaya juna kuambia maze, una pesa, una tulemea, tukulele mtoto. Eh, hey, kala is bad, kala is bad. Ah, ah. We are not going to do that. Come on. And by the way, you have very interesting points. Yeah. Unisema, it, that's actually one of the points you've made. Mtu wasipate pesa kama, mtu wasipate mtoto kama ana pesa. Real talk. Do, do I need to explain that? But akuna venye, understand separate, this, huh? Se, separate that from the background ya tuzane to jaze dunia. Unajua? <laughs> of course, bado eni mtuwa kanisa. Now, of course, if I'm giving ideas, I'm not God. So ka una nisikiza ka mungu wa feel the earth, maze you need to check on your religion. You are lost, okay? What I would say is this, huh? Don't go around. You know, everybody knows how to have kids, eh? Huh? You are not going to tell me you went to some guy's house and then drank juice. <laughs> and then kiasi kiasi, you have children. Uh-huh. You have to understand that if you have kids, this is a decision, huh? Mm-hmm. Now, as Kelala, me, I'm, I'm sorry about this, but I'm pro-contraceptive, right? So don't go be having kids and then talking about it to me at 2K. You and I, you socks. I'm not it. I'm not it. Don't call me. What I believe in is... If you want to have kids, kids are like having a degree. Uki drop out kusumbua. Now if you have kids, they don't have the money for kusumbua. So don't come to me and tell me kalala. I'm not those people. I believe in if you want to have kids, ensure you're mentally, uh, financially, emotionally, and physically ready. Okay? Don't just show up and say, hey, hey, Russia never pink. <laughs> <laughs> Bona, is it baby pink? Is it turquoise pink? Is it blood pink? Which pink? Mm-hmm. Because we are not showing up. And wh- where do you learn such heavy stuff? Yeah, how people need to be responsible for their lives. And again, at your age, without experience, because most people prefer to learn from experience. Okay. Where you can get it from? Is from what you see other people going through? Ama watu ame kuchokesha na kukuomba tuke. I mean, I've been, I've been, I'm a last born. And I've been the last born for the longest time, okay? So what experiences, I mean experiencing uh, breadcrumbs of life, okay? People go through everything, and then they come back with a book. Book one, life. Book two, a, a teenager. Book three, uh, having kids. Book four, uh, adolescence. As in, as a last born, we are didn't, we're never given a chance to understand life. We are taught how to learn from people's experience, okay? Design in a thicker place. Uh, okay, this is a bad exp- example, eh? Maze, mali kibaki koko maze ni kini kuku. Okay? <laughs> You're like, what? <laughs> and then you come and say, unajua, unajua kimi ya teacher kwa form one, unajua nani ya kwa form three, unajua nini temeliwa. Like, at the end of the day, it gets to a place where, as last bonds, I know, uh, first bonds, unakonga and say, hey, unajua ni tumawale, tumawale. And I'm like, Metulea na mali yetu. Amuja tulea. Hey. You know, it gets to a place where you're, you, oh, you're not even inheriting land. You're inheriting alone. Uh, umeingia kwa, kwa, kwa industry yenye inakamna. Like King Kalala ni celeb. Uh, yeah. Mshua, uh, mtu kama wewe especially, ni ngumu hata kutembea tao. Majowe ni celeb. Ya na ni wongo, wuna ni pili. <laughs> no, <laughs> we ni celeb. Nime pega la hapa, hapo, hapo, <laughs> mwave, nime pega yeah. la hapa dead. Na pan tambua. Yeah. But anyway, uh, you, you know what that means. Like, yeah. ah, ni aji, um, you're, you're a person who many people listen to. Right. Kuna expectations that come with that. Yeah. I think I respect your simplicity. Uh, you are actually making fun at umebai viatu so nani. For real, you don't believe me? No, I, I do. I do. I just find it interesting that you have not conformed to uh, my ideas of what comes with uh, who I am. You have not conformed to Izoma ideas of what comes with who a public figure should be. You right. don't care. Right? You and I will say, I'm going to navigate. I'm going to say, 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 I mean, <laughs> 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 Eh. Bana nduna ni to nane. Eh no I mean I would say I wouldn't say that uh, it's a lot. All I would say ni unjo maseleb kuna hii eh sound flani ya muniombe. Niko na shida nimejiletea muniombe. Muniombe. 
Yeah. You see, you're selling this idea that you live in a place that you pay uh, 100 bands for a one bedroom, you're wearing 19,000 shoes, but you 65 downstairs, and you see, you're setting yourself up for failure. So, I don't know if you're going to say, I don't know if you Mtajua. Because you see, there's no way I'm going to be. <laughs> no, 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 There's no way I'm going to buy a car that is worth uh, 30 million. Alafu ni metint. Ah, ah. Mutaniona. Mutaniona. Hey! Mutaniona. But see, that's exactly what these people are doing. So now you like. see with them. <laughs> hey! <laughs> As in, also, uh, what I would say with celebrities, to Konaile Gonja Flani, ah. Also, on a fucking check, you want to do it, want to do it, want to do it. When I could be a nanny, but I won't make a good day last night. Okay, so they don't have that thing now with me. Miss Nakele, Jew, Mina Takan, you're mocking his shine. Mini can mock him to you. Well, I'm to you. You know how you told that he, uh, a rich man with a big car splashed water on poor people. I'm the rich man. You. <laughs> 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 Si ni kelea kazi ni daddy eh. alafu ati humility hiyo eh. ni matuza wapi mm. cannot be me so now with uh, the with our Kenyan audience mse bana doba mbili 2 billion views unataka kutembelea juu wewe nani bro tulia wewe so, unakuja interview is your boy whose boy <laughs> so humility yako ni due to unavoidable circumstances Unavoid, <laughs> mini victim of circumstances <laughs> G class ana yeye mtaona Guy, mtawatembelea juu ya vichwa. Hiyo ni expect. Na hii time nimetapika. I'm sorry na niko uchi, okay. <laughs> as in uh, like I believe in there's no such thing as bragging, okay? Kama uko nayo uko nayo, right? Kama kuna msana anawapigia matope hapo na gari flani mjaye ona ako na dona amna. Si ah. Yeye ameomoka, nyi mnateseka, okay? <laughs> so when you shine, you shine. Hakuna <laughs> kitu kama atina brag. Mm. You have it. Bwana. It's not bragging. It's, it's not shining. bragging. It's happening. It's happening. Wewe <laughs> ndio jacket kwa benzi yangu. Come on. Unateseka. Maskini takataka. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so when you when, when you, in short what you're saying, when you maskini ume accept. <laughs> that siku moja. I've said I've said. Mimi si ati sina parking. Save my parking for 2027. Please. 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 Okay? Stop, stop making people feel sorry for their success. They are successful. You are not. Deal with it. Denial is a river in Egypt. You are poor, they are not. Hey, Kalala, Kalala. Me and me, Missina, like any banana. Nikitao, nikitao. So is it kabla, apa apa kabla kabla baza. So is it accurate to describe you as a rich woman trapped in a poor woman's body? Come on, come on, come on. My boy. Iko sawa. When you my spirit animal. Oh, me sasa ni my your boy. Ah, come on. Ah, so if you're poor, you're poor. It's allowed. Eh. You know, you are number one billion number last. So. Yes. So, but then that's a, also a very interesting point yeah. that Kama Hauna, Hauna. Hauna. Usioneshe watu uko nayo. Ana usilie pia usijinyonge. Hauna. Hauna. Kwa lakini ukiwa nayo. Hiyo de. Hiyo de. Hi. Amtaweza. Eh. Machozi nguo tunapiga tu nduru. Hey, nimeomoka. Oi, mamangu nimeomoka. <laughs> Final word kwa madem uh, na machali wa yangu wanaingia kwa industry. Uh, industry ni yoyote, mtu anatafuta job. Uh, you've never had to look for a job in your life. Okay, that's that's kidogo tough but the truth. Sindio? Yeah. You've never had to look for a job in your life. Go, so go. if everybody watching us would apply your formula, we'll deal with the unemployment perpendicularly. I mean, what I would say is this, huh? Number 1, um, of course, kuna yu element flani ya shule. Ya yeah, study hard. Yeah. Eh, study hard maze. Sekata ni kujia. Study hard, read hard maze. Eh, kuja kuwa na PhD. But what would say is this, huh? Every single day when you wake up in the morning, there's always that thing. Either it's cooking, or it's cleaning, or it's working out, or it's agriculture, or it's jumping, or it's doing uh, physical, whatever. In a mess na wewe. That's it. That's it. That's the one. 
So keep doing it, keep doing it, and don't stop. That's where your success is at. Long live the clan, and of course, we strike it down. So you may say, but you got a cool is a Ulcona so many JK. What? Bona, 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 Bachelor of Commerce, minimum gear become as a marketing. A lafu, bona lecture, Rashika Simu, as a. Hey! 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 Turn the call. Ashika Simu. Ashika Simu, as a Jomo Kenyatta, I was doing a Bachelor of Commerce. Uh, second class upper division. Remember, si usani to pia unafaa kuwa na kili ya understand ndio usani na kupeleka. That's it for the weekend edition. See you next week. My name is Dr. Kingori.